Section two, five through seven. In which quadrant would you expect point O to be located? Now let's recall, this is quadrant one, this is quadrant two, quadrant three, and quadrant four. We also wanna make sure that we know that they start in the upper right-hand corner and go counterclockwise, written in Roman numerals. Well, we could easily see it's not gonna be four. There was no way, this line segment doesn't even go through quadrant four. It could possibly be in one, but I think that's too far up, right? It could be in three, but that's very little that we're in quadrant three. So the majority of our line in that area would be quadrant two. Compare your method with your partner and check the reasonableness of your answer. Justify why the coordinate pair for point O is correct or incorrect. If the office were located three-fourths of the way from your math classroom to your cafeteria, would you expect the X or the Y coordinate of point A to be negative and explain? Okay. If it were three-fourths of the way, would you expect either value to be negative? X or Y. Probably not because we would get more positive. We would keep rising and running over and over again. So <clears throat> neither would be negative. On to the last section which is example A.